To download and install Forge for 1.19.4, it's actually very simple. So the first thing you need to do is to open our Minecraft launcher. And once you're here, you want to select the version drop down menu and you want to select the version of Minecraft you want Forge for. Once you're ready, you want to click on play. So once Minecraft opens up, that means the files have been successfully downloaded, which means we can quit the game and start to install Forge. So to download Minecraft Forge, the first thing we need to do is to go to our web browser and you want to go to files.minecraftforge.net. Alternatively, I will leave a link in the description. Once you're here, you want to select your Minecraft version on this drop down menu on the side. But in this case, we want to use 1.19.4. Once you're on the 1.19.4 installation, you want to click on the install button in the middle of the screen. And then you want to wait 5 seconds for the advert. And once you're ready, you want to click on the skip button in the top right. You then want to go ahead and download the installer to your computer. So in this case, I'm going to use my desktop. So once the Forge is downloaded to our computer, we just need to go ahead and install it. So to do this, you want to right click on the Forge installer, hover over open with, and you want to select the Java platform. If you still don't see this, you want to click on choose another app. Then you want to select the Java platform from the list of applications here. If you still don't see this, you will need to download Java to your computer. Now I'll leave a link in the description for that below. So once you're ready, you want to click on always. And then the Forge installer should open up and it will look like this. So installing Forge is actually very simple. All we need to do is select the client installation. Alternatively, if you're using a server, you want to select the server installation. You then want to check your Minecraft installation and make sure that's correct, in which case it is. And then you want to click on OK. It will then begin to install Forge to your Minecraft, and this will take a few seconds. So once Forge has finished its all in, the pop-up box will say it's been successfully installed. So you just want to go ahead and click on OK, and now Forge has been installed to Minecraft. So to install Forge mods, it's actually very simple. The first thing you need to do is to open our Minecraft launcher, and you want to select on the version drop-down menu, and you should see the Forge option. If you don't, you will need to restart your launcher. Once you're ready, you want to click on play, then you want to select I understand the risks, and click on play. So once Minecraft has opened up, you know you've installed Forge because you see the information in the bottom left. So to install mods to Minecraft, all we need to do is to select mods, and then you want to click on open mods folder. From here, all we need to do is just simply drag and drop mods into this folder. So in this case, I'm going to drag and drop this journey map mod that I downloaded earlier. Once you're ready, you want to exit out of file explorer, and then you want to go ahead and restart your Minecraft launcher. So once you've restarted Minecraft, you'll notice it will show you how many mods are currently loaded in the bottom left. To view a list of your mods, you want to click on the mods option, and here it's going to show you all of the mods you've currently got loaded on this left hand side menu. So all we need to do now is click on done, and go ahead and start playing Minecraft without mods, just as we normally would. And that's it, so if you have any questions or comments, leave them below, and I'll reply to you as soon as I can.